Hi, I'm Carlos. I came to Ibiza in 1969, organizing the first big party in, on the island. Well, it's completely different. I was going around on my horse. There was no paved roads. There was no practically no hotels, no discotheques. I mean, it was a Virgin Island, nothing to do with now. Now it's a, it's a big business. It's full of hotels, full of restaurants, full of discotheques, boutiques and everything. And uh, the port is full of yachts, uh, 100 private planes every day landing in Ibiza. It was, it was another world, the, the, the opposite. He really loved it and immediately he wanted to open a discotheque and uh, I helped him in 1973. The opening night, like maybe 300, everybody was a friend. We, we knew each other. Everybody was dressed uh, the, the hippie look. It was disco music, reggae and funk. They started at, at 12 and they finished at 4. I remember in 1973, for instance, I took uh, the king of Bulgaria with his wife, with Maria, which was uh, the, the daughter of the last, last king of Italy, and people like that. And they were dancing in the middle of, of the dancing floor with people who didn't even recognize them. You know? In Ibiza we had a total freedom, and it was completely different what, what was happening than to what was happening in, in the mainland. For 20 years I've done the, the VIP Flower Power. They open a door especially for me behind Pasha. And then I have 300 friends. And also when famous people are around, which I invite them. Valentino, Armani, Etro, like uh, Rafa Nadal, Shakira, Naomi Campbell, Pete Moss. Well, Ibiza has a kind of magic, has nothing to do with the DJs. But the freedom is all over the place. Yes, I love Ibiza. I was married to Ibiza when she was a girl 18. Very nice, very beautiful. Now she's 84. She's fat, wrinkled, but is my wife.